welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad that you are here today. Just a quick reminder before I get started, don't forget to subscribe. I'm bringing you this wig review today for PinkyPromise.com. Go to the Pinky Promise website and sign up to receive their emails and you can get a code to save 30%. You can also email support at PinkyPromise.com if you ever have any wig related questions. So today we're going to take a look at another one of these brand new Rock Hill Welch styles from their new Lux Light Cap collection. This is Bella Vida and the color on this one is Shaded Iced Pumpkin 2933 SS. More on her in just a minute. Okay, let's start taking a look at this beautiful new style, Bella Vita. So Bella Vita is definitely one of my favorites from this new collection. So um, I have posted a little bit of information about these wigs, but in case you haven't seen those, this is a new cap construction. They are considered to be petite average. However, I do find that there is you know, a little extra room in the cap where they will definitely fit average and just maybe, you know, slightly above average. But on my petite head, they fit really nicely. They fit great ear to ear. I haven't had to bring in the draw the uh, adjusters for the I was gonna say drawstrings. <laughs> These aren't pants. Um, the adjusters uh, for my circumference and forehead to nape. They are it, you know the cap is fitting me really nicely too. So, but like I said, if I stretch the cap out a little bit, there is a little bit of extra stretch in places where I do think it would fit you if you're average and slightly above average. So just really, really pretty. So these are the true to life heat friendly fibers in this collection. Uh, we've got a sheer lace uh, front temple to temple with a left mono part as opposed to having a full mono top. So we'll get into the cap in just a little while. So I will do a turn so you can see her all the way around and then we'll get into all of her specs. So here we are from the front. This style is very reminiscent of Editor's Pick, um, Simmer, Wavy Day, you know, just has a really pretty wavy pattern. So here's my left. The back. My right. And back to the front. Okay, so we can look at the sheer lace front here. So lace front is temple to temple, extends down onto the ear tabs. So you've got great coverage there. Looks very natural, like it's growing out of your head. Just what we want. And then I'll show you the part. This part was a little harder, I think with the waves, a little harder to open, but. And then ear tabs. So I've got great coverage around the face. I do have just a tiny little bit of bio hair here, so you can kind of use that as an indicator for how much bio hair you know might show on you. If you um, are gonna have some bio hair showing, just think about what shade you're choosing, you know, so you can blend that in because that may show a little bit for you at the ear tabs there. I just don't have a lot of hair there, so. Okay, so measurement wise for this one, we have a 10 and a half inch layer here in the front. So she does not have any kind of a short bang or anything like that. 12.25 uh, at the crown. We have 10 and a quarter, 10.25 inches on the sides. And then the nape back here is six inches. So plenty of length, you know, to do some fun styling with her. And um, just think she's a really, really great mid-length style. Weight-wise, 4.4 ounces. So she's very, very lightweight. Okay, I will pop her off and we can take a look at this new Lux Light cap show you that it's just hard to show you that part this this one just needs a little more work so but you know I don't like to do a ton to these when I'm doing the review just so you can see it pretty much out of the box okay <clears throat> so sorry you can see my fingers under there because that's all hand tied up there so we have a left monofilament part right here and then we have the sheer lace front which is extended goes true temple to temple up here we have hand tied and that hand tied area, you know, extends back to the back of the wig. So there is just some netting up here that it gives you a layer in between where they tied those knots and, you know, what's up against your head there. So, okay, so the ear tabs have silicone, which is nice. That gives a lot of grip, especially if you don't have hair right there. And then hand tied all through this portion of the cap but it does have some closed wefting here at the back, as you can see. You often see that on hand-tied caps, you still have the appearance of having a hand-tied cap, still looks very natural, where anywhere you separate the hair, which I'll show you, I didn't, I did not show you that earlier, but um, you know, that's very common to see, just kind of strengthens that back and helps the hair lay right. So this one does have the extended nape, so it does have silicone on the nape as well, which is nice. So that's giving me really, really nice grip there. 
and then Velcro adjusters. So there's a little stretch in the circumference and there's just a little stretch, not really stretch here in the middle, you know, in this middle part of the cap, a little stretch on these sides. So just keep in mind that these are considered to be petite average. So they are, you know, designed to fit a smaller size head. I will show you here, you know, so anywhere you separate the hair, you're gonna have that appearance of scalp with a hand tied cap. So that's just really nice. So when you're styling and stuff like that, you know, it's just gonna look like scalp there, which is really nice. So, okay, so let's start talking about this beautiful color. This is quickly becoming one of my favorite, my favorite auburns. I just love this color. I reviewed it a while back on uh, Captivating Canvas, and I think that was the first time I'd ever tried it. And it's just a beautiful rooted auburn, just really, really pretty color. So this is Shaded Iced Pumpkin, and the color code is 2933SS for this one. So beautiful, beautiful color. So the description for sh Shaded Iced Pumpkin <clears throat> is a dark auburn and strawberry bon blonde blend with icy pale blonde highlights. So there's a little bit of a pale blonde highlight going through there and dark roots. So there's your root. You're gonna see your rooting, you know, on the color anywhere you separate the hair. But it's not too, you know, it doesn't stray too far from the auburns. So I think it's a very natural looking root color. So, so again, you can see that kind of pale highlight there at the, particularly at the lace front. Really pretty. Beautiful, you know, dimensional auburn. Here we are under my patio cover. See that beautiful red. And you can see what I'm talking about with the root that it doesn't really stray that far from the auburn, so. So here we are in natural light. It is windy, I'm sorry about the wind noise. So you can see the dimension in the color. You can see the rooting, show you the lace. It's in the sun. take a look at styling and all that stuff. So she's going to be a little more challenging to tuck. This side where you're on the, you know, thinner side of the left mono part is easier to tuck. But over here with having this bang layer, even, you know, being almost as long as the sides, I don't know that you're going to get a lot of ear tuckability out of that. You know, you can tuck it, but it's just a little bulky, you know, behind the ear. So I would still consider this one to be low density. It's not poofy. There's no permatease or anything like that, of course, with the hand tie cap. But I think just the way it's styled and the, the different lengths of the layers, you know, that that's what's lending it to not be as ear tuckable. There's this one hair. I apologize. I know y'all can probably see it. I can see it. <laughs> I just can't get it to get out of my face. Go away. Anyway, so, okay. So I'll show you what the glass is. Very easy to get the glasses on. Like I said, this is low density. The cap is very, you know, um, fits very nicely. And so, so you can easily put your glasses up as well. I would tuck the hair behind your ears and then put the glasses up. You know what, this hair, you're gonna go. That's what I do when a hair is a nuisance. I just yank it out, so. But anyway, glasses will go up on the head or if you wanted to, I think these waves would also hold your glasses fairly well too. So yeah, holds them pretty good. So, okay, so we can look at headbands and stuff like that. Let's see how she does for the headband. Okay, so obviously, you know, you can get her in a headband and you can put that full bang layer back in that headband if you want to. So, you know, for work or whatever, if you need to be looking down, that would be a great way to keep the hair out of your face, you know, um, but if you want to, you do have this very pretty wave right by the face, so you could pull that out as well. You know, you can do it either way. But if you wanna use the headband or some clips to get the hair out of your face with this long bang, it's very easy to do that. So, really pretty. 
Okay, so she has the length for half up, half down. Again, when you put her half up, half down, you can include your bang in that if you want to, or you can work out a little layer here and just have some layering around the face if you want to do it that way. So either way, the bang is long enough to stay back in a clip. Then she does have enough of, whoops, her nape, six inches. Yeah, she has a six inch nape, so you could do a little pony, a little updo, you know. It's not gonna be a real long pony, but if you just wanna get the hair off your neck, you can certainly do that. It's really pretty. And then of course, with this pretty lace front, you can wear that, you know, you could wear it pulled back with clips and, um, you know, just show off that beautiful coverage that you have there with that nice lace front. So really, really pretty. I'm just, I really love this new collection. I'm very pleased with these styles so far. So really pretty. Okay, I wanna thank Pinky Promise for sending this wig to review for you all today. There'll be purchase information in the drop down box, box down below this video. Thanks so much for watching. Take care of yourselves. And until next time, don't forget, you're absolutely beautiful. Bye. <laughs>